Rice University receives $100 million for a new student center. NGSA Solar Farm is seeking approval. And Dream Fighter Home acquires assets from Maguire Home Builders. Thank you for tuning to Construction Business TV. My name is Josh Rivia, and this is your Houston Video. Hello and welcome back to this edition of Weekly Update. If this is your first time to the channel, welcome. We're glad to have you here with us. I'd like to first mention if you are on commercial real estate, residential real estate, or a trade of any kind involving construction, go to the description right down below and schedule a free interview to be featured here on Construction Business TV. Also, I'd like to mention hit that bell and subscribe button also down below to stay up to date on what's happening in construction business. Okay, let's hit that first story. Okay, our first story today is about DreamFinder Homes acquiring assets from Maguire Home Builders. So DreamFinder Homes Incorporated will pay $475 million to acquire the home building, mortgage banking, and title insurance assets from Maguire Home Builders Incorporated. Founder of Maguire, Frank Maguire, said in a statement, my strategic priority in identifying a merger partner was to ensure that our people and the Coventry brand would have the opportunity to grow post-merger. DreamFinder Homes will acquire approximately 1,850 homes, 600, 600 of which are in Houston. The deal is expected to close in the fourth quarter of this year, 2021. Okay, our next story today is about NGSA seeking a f approval for a solar farm. So NGSA is considering building a $380 million solar power and battery storage project. Five Wells Solar Center LLC project will be in Bell County, Texas and has a production capacity of 350 megawatts as well as a battery storage of 265 megawatts. This will also be NG's first combined solar power production and energy storage facility on a utility scale. NG is also applying for tax exempts under Chapter 313. Five Wells is scheduled to begin construction in 2022 and finish in 2023. This is one part of the previous year's solar boom in Texas. Okay, our last story up today is about Rice University receiving that $100 million. So, the Moody Foundation is giving Rice University a $100 million gift, which will be used to build a new student center. This gift ties for the largest in the school's history. The Moody Center for Student Life and Opportunity will replace the existing, over 60 years old Rice Memorial Center. At Hay. Associates are designing the new building with Kendall Heaton Associates serving as the executive architect and Telepson will provide pre-construction services. Groundbreaking for the new building is expected early 2022 and expected completion in late 2023. Thank you again for watching this edition of Weekly Update. If you liked the video make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Hope you all have a wonderful day and I will see you next week.